Frankie Slauson here, and uh, well, not a whole lot going on today. I just uh, this video is kind of late, as you can see. We're kind of kind of driving home, and you know, I'm driving home anyway. I don't often wait till later at night when I'm driving home from work to make a vlog, but I, I didn't, you know, I was really busy today. On days that are paydays, I get really, really busy. You know, being that there isn't a whole lot of time because <coughs> they only give me an hour for lunch. And then, it's like, after I take the lunch break, then it's like, like tonight, I have to, you know, I have, to, I have an early shift in the morning. So I have to, I'm, I'm really limited on time today, is what I'm saying. But uh, in tomorrow's vlog, we're going to talk about, uh, we're going to talk about the, uh, what are we going to talk about? I, I brought up a, I was bringing up a, or thinking of a good subject that we could talk about or discuss, and you guys give me your thoughts on it. And I was thinking maybe what we could talk about is like certain childhood stars, like not just the same ones like Jonathan Taylor Thomas or Macaulay Culkin. I'm talking the ones that were like in Ghostbusters 2, uh, Problem Child, uh, what else? Uh, like, look who's talking. Like, like those kids that, you know, you don't know who they, really, they, who they are, you know, by name. But, you know, you kind of wonder what happened to them. Or, you know, did they disappear, you know, they disappear, but where'd they go? <clears throat> You'll know who I'm talking about you know, in tomorrow's vlog. I don't have more time to do that. So yeah, I'll, I'll have a proper lunch time or whatnot. And I'll just do it by a vehicle. Uh, but uh, today, I was going to mention, you know, one thing I forgot to talk about that I should have talked about. Maybe I can just do it right here. Now, since it's, yeah. One thing I forgot to talk about was uh, the fact is that uh, that mystery DVD that I sent out here a couple weeks ago to a friend of mine. <clears throat> By now, I, said, I think a few people know who, what it was or who, who I sent it to. <coughs> I sent it to uh, Sean Phillips. And the DVD that I sent it to, or sent, was uh, Treehouse Hostages. Or, you know, it was Treehouse Hostage. The movie with Jim Barney, one of his last movies that he was in before he passed away. And the reason why I got it for him was because, well, Sean and his brother Ethan have been, to me, really good. You know, they were really nice to me all. You know, they were nice to me, mentioned me in their videos and all that stuff. And, and, and I figured, well, you know, you know, Sean was looking for that DVD, and he was right. I mean, certain places online were charging you know, like eighty-five dollars for it. And I couldn't believe it. And I went on Amazon.com, and it was like eighty-five dollars for a brand new copy. But what you didn't know was you could get a used copy, which somebody in Minnesota had it. I think like Rochester or whatever, or Roosevelt. <clears throat> anyway, somebody had it. And they only wanted like twelve dollars for it, so it was a used copy. And I said, "Well, I'll, you know, they can just send it to me. You know, I'll, I'll buy it." I told Sean I would buy it for him, and then I'd ship it out to him whenever I could. You know, like you know, as soon as I got paid last time, and I did. And uh, but I, it was, since it was a used copy, it was already open. Like you know, I didn't have to take a little special wrapping off or whatever just a bubble wrap package that was in there. Uh, but yeah, I, I didn't really have to, I didn't really have to, uh, you know, it was already used, used copy and the disc was perfect. So, what I did was, I I, I, I watched, watched it myself before I sent it out to Sean <clears throat> to make sure everything was working properly, just to test it out. And it was good and the boot is really great, I, I do recommend it. Uh, if you don't know what video I'm talking about, as far as uh, you know, what, uh, if you didn't see Sean's video, it's, a, it's not the video that they just made, Sean M. Day, but it was the one they made last week, um, just their random update, and they do mention about me in their video, All right. <coughs> Sean thanks me for making, you know, setting up the video, and see, I didn't tell him how much I paid for it, he probably thought I paid $85 for it, but no, I only paid like $12 for it, and I, I can only say that it's probably the only movie that I know for a fact that, that I and my, you know, myself and Sean have watched together at the same, well not at the same time, but it's 
the only movie that we watched, you know, to, you know at, at different times or whatever. The same disc. I'm sure you watched it right away after I, after you said, after you got it. But <clears throat> anyway, so that if you're wondering anyway, because I kind of forgot to mention about that after this video was aired. I should have mentioned it last week as soon as it was aired, but I wanted to wait till you did a, 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 a review on it or, or thank me for it. Uh, one, one way or another, but I totally forgot about it. So I figured I'd mention that today. To after tomorrow's video, it'll be a lot more interesting, and then I'll let you guys know what DVDs and Blu-rays I picked up this weekend. So we'll see you guys tomorrow for another great DVD, uh, <laughs> another great daily summer vlog here on the Frank Slash Show channel on YouTube.com.